Hi guys, I'm close to the new Range Rover Sport, the 2018 model here. Uh, I'm going quickly show you around uh, how the car looks like and after I'm going inside for you guys to see uh, how is the interior. So this is how it looks, this new beauty. This one here is an autobiography and is a 4.4 4. 4. 4 um, liters. So, here's the badge. It looks beautiful. So, let's have a look inside on the back seats first. Panoramic roof. Here are some sensors that I don't know exactly what they are for, um, but I believe that it's uh, to let people know uh, when is the side steps, but I'm not sure. That has. Oh, just a sec. It looks beautiful with the ultraviolet ambient lights. So let's have a look inside. So I'm now inside the new, the new Range Rover Sport. Um, I'm starting from this bit here. Uh, this is basically touch as well, um, like the, like the Velar. Um, even it can be a little bit different than the Velar. Uh, I will just turn on the car because it will be easy for you guys to see. You see, this is like an aluminum finish. Uh, it's plastic but it looks really smart uh, here is just basically is touch uh, even it looks touch but I can see that is actually a button and here just to put the mirrors in mirrors out as the black spot As you can see, it's very similar like the Velar and the steering wheel. Uh, even the, the screen, it's very similar as well. The central console, it's very similar. The handle is, is different. So this is the sport style uh, from the previous models. And so basically it's the Range Rover Sport all the time had this handle. Um, It's pretty similar like the, the Velar. Uh, if you have seen my previous videos, um, you can see that it's very similar. This one has a 360 cameras. Uh, I'm not sure if it would be possible to see how it works. And okay, so let's have a look. So the front camera, the dual view front camera the camera from the top and um, basically you just can when you are just parking the car it's easier uh, for you to, to see if there's any obstacles uh, around the, the vehicle um, the back camera and pretty much like the 360 so basically you can just see all the cars around uh, or as I said, if there's any obstacles around. So let's back. And here pretty much is uh, the same as the, the Velar. The screen and the options, the in-control apps as well that you can, can put it on. But I don't have the phone now connected so it will not work the in-control apps. Uh, the ambient lights 
the same colors as the new Valar. Now it's ultraviolet. If I change for red, it's really nice. I, I quite enjoy this, this line here. Uh, it looks really smart in my opinion. And the lights, the red one, the electric blue. Looks nice as well, actually. Uh, this one as well has the um, head-up display, uh, as you can see here, that is the head-up display, here is where is the screen fitted, and the screen will just reflect all the information to the windscreen, um, so that, that is an option uh, with, the, with the Range Rover Sport, uh, so you can just add it on when you are buying your, your new Sport. Another thing that I would like to show you that is actually a really, really nice thing is the active key. The active key uh, is, for example, if you are going to the beach or any lake, a river, uh, and you are going on your own, for example, um, and you are afraid, okay, where I will just leave my car keys? Because you never know, you can be swimming and someone can just grab your stuff and steal your car so that can happen with the active key you can leave the keys inside the car and just wearing this because this it looks like a watch as you can see it looks like like a watch of course don't have any numbers it's just like really really simple but has a sensor inside and that when you are close to the car will open the car if you leave the keys inside uh, and if your car has a key uh, keyless entry it will not be any problem at all because the car will only open if you are close by with this because that you just need to to go on the back of the car i believe that is or um it's on the boot and that will unlock the car so and you can access your stuff your key your car key um so it will not be a problem at all that is actually a really cool feature that uh, land rover invented um, and it's nice so it's nice uh, the glove box now you probably will not see so well I'm trying to wait just putting the lights on um, but I believe that is a bit dark anyway but it's the same size of the the previous port uh, the, the top one it's smaller because the CD player is just on the top um, so just take some of the space so it's not much space left there to put some stuff just some glasses sunglasses the wallet um, and just small things to be honest so, so this is how it looks the the new sport uh, if you guys have any other questions please feel free to leave me a message and I will be more than happy to to answer all the questions and if you want to see something more on a detail about the new sport please leave a message as well or leave a comment saying what you would like to see what you would want me to explain more on the detail about this new new model thank you so much for watching and please subscribe my channel and thumbs up uh, if you like this video and thank you once again for watching all my videos thank you guys